Alright guys, welcome back to Let's Play Epic Battle Fantasy IV. So, in the last episode, we got the medal for Dark Seductress. Defeat a busty succubus on epic difficulty. I wonder who that could be. We still have three others, so let's do it now. Uh, there's something wrong with Lance's face. He's missing the bottom of his jaw. Okay. Uh, what is he weak against? Okay. Dark Lance. Uses mostly dark fire and thunder elemental attacks. Summons defenders. Okay, he's weak to explosions. Ironic, right? And light. Okay, let's uh, leave and re-equip. Didn't even lower his accuracy. It's unfortunate. Die, monster! You don't belong in this world! Drop some bombs. What? Oh. Oh, no. Right now, Genesis. Hey, that's my tank. Has it malfunctioned or something? It's aimed the wrong way. What is it doing? Uh oh. This should blind the foes for a while, and hopefully we won't make so many hits. We won't take so many hits now. I think Lance might be easier.
Not easy enough, though. I might die here. Or is accuracy even further? It doesn't go below It was annoying. There we go. And the world is spared from another nuclear winter. Woo. Cool. Kill this one. We are hyper beam. Only twenty two and a half thousand. Yeah, that's a real attack. The fallen comrade. So there was a minor interruption between the the, the Lance battle over here and the current thing, as in I haven't recorded in a while. Uh, episode 31 just went up like 10 minutes ago. <laughs> I had some interruption due to family things, and th this is my little preface thing. Now, guys, we're going to act like that never happened and just go on and be all fancy and stuff. Um, Let's jump into this battle. <laughs> wow, it's evil me. Is that really what I'm going to look like when I die? Grim. I don't want to die ever. Yeah, I didn't figure that would actually work. Okay. I'm not going to be the, do the smart thing and just, you know, stay in this battle and take advantage of the stagger and everything. I'm going to re-equip myself out of battle, unless I have all my equipment set correctly. Dark Matt uses mostly non elemental and debuffing attacks, has high defense and very high critical hit rate, summons undying sky and viking monoliths. He's weak to earth and light. He's immune to darkness okay be right back that, that's not the right that's the yeah that that mat doesn't look too bright just like the real one wait does this does everyone have a dialogue no not everyone does you know what I'm gonna do this until something happens at the beginning Auto res. That, that, that's good. Um. Okay. We're gonna swap out you for now. Because I need to start by buffing us. And debuffing the enemy. I know that the monoliths at least can use magic attacks. So it's worth buffing us. Oh no. Ow. So painful. The pain level is off the charts. Okay. 
now. It's dispel. Um. How do they feel about light? They don't care either way. They all care about earth, though, right? Yes. Perfect. Boom. Boom. And they're almost half dead. Now, cleave. Nice crits. Ow. All of Matt's attacks are physical, so that makes choosing our equips and buffs easy. Okay. Um, they're all weak to... Well, they don't care either way about light. But let's do this. Genesis. Okay, now that they're all weakened... Uh, actually, let's focus him for the moment. Stagger, perfect. And use my most powerful Earth skill, which hopefully is fully upgraded. Well, that was awesomer than I thought it would be. Ow. They dispelled the... Okay, that's unfortunate. Which means I have to waste his turn. And... Yeah, let's just pop a chips. Oh no, such pain. <laughs> and you're staggered now. Awesome. Or... Maybe you're not. I guess the first one is the one that staggered, and the second one actually did it. Um, start off with attacking. You know what? Uh, I think this should be fine. 87,000. Nice. Yeah, it's... Alright, perfect. Cool. I wonder if this will distract Matt. Matt, are you get becoming weaker? No. Damn. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. I would actually expect something like that to work. Ah, oh, yes, most unfortunate. Res you. Heal us all. And let's get a defense boost. Oh, come on. Not you two. The spell. There we go, perfect. Does he resist a spell? Yes, 70%. So I got lucky. And another crit. Perfect. He seems to score a lot of critical hits. If only there was some way of blocking those. I mean, there is. Um... Let's buff everyone. Now that I know that you can dispel, it's actually more worth it to do that. Um, is it even worth getting rid of that thing? I mean, it was one turn. It was not worth it. The world all. Cool. Auto res. So he used his limit break, hence why he was able to summon those. So it probably would have happened either way. Sure it's fine, though. Uh, buff everyone's defense, because this is going to hurt. Yeah. Of course, this is going to happen no matter what. I 
am really lucky I have these auto reses, though. Heal us all. Our limit breaks are almost back up. Thank you, auto res. Um. I hate to say it, but it's actually better to use her turn to deal damage. Not enough. Okay, limit break, a go-go. You know what, actually? Not just Limit Break a go-go. Let's buff you. Skill time. <laughs> that was what you spent your turn doing? Okay, uh, I guess I'll spend my turn doing something really good. Weakening you. It didn't work. Alright, never mind. I wasted it. And critical hits. All right, I'll just use my turn for light. Okay, my limit break is up. I do not, okay, never mind. Just hit you with light once again. Seriously, do you spell that buff? Stop dispelling me. Finally. And now he has his limit break too. Great. Okay, to make sure you don't die, let's get rid of that 50% decrease to your defense. Increase our defense. And make you go ham. Go for it. The world. Well, he insta killed. Great. He would not have killed Matt otherwise. Genesis once again. They're all weak to Earth, right? No, they're not. Uh, they're all weak to Bomb, though. Eh. I have an idea. Okay, first things first. Heal. 
We need to swap her to the back row because we need Lance's bombs right about now. Perfect. Almost enough damage. Uh, this probably isn't enough. Oh, it is. Cool. Heavily lower their firepower. You know what, actually? Swap you to the back. Throw out a coffee. It's coffee in the way you feel. A drill spear? Is he gonna use. Oh no, it was so painful. <laughs> uh, okay, I'm gonna try to dispel his 50% increase to his attack. It worked. Uh, let's increase our defense. Okay, that's unfortunate. Ah, yes, most unfortunate. Perfect. I wasn't expecting him to change weapons, but that actually makes a lot of sense. Okay. Boom. Yeah, of course you're dead. <laughs> there was no way you were surviving that. Let's just try to deal damage to him. Um. You know what? Buff us. We need it. Figured that was about to happen again. I'm totally not using her as bait or anything to keep the damage off people. Debilitate. Yes. And damage. Ah, he has his limit break. Okay, now we need chips. Thank you for the limit break. Just going to use, actually, even better, swap you to the back. Since I'm using coffee anyway. Alright. Mighty. You know what? Oh, he's out of MP as well. Fine. Um. Mighty Oak without buffs, sadly. And Cleaver without buffs. Almost. Okay. Take guns. Yes, now I don't have to look at that at my ugly mug anymore. Cool. Okay, get you up front. Tank guns. And a good old fashioned res. Okay, there are we two bombs and that's about it, but I suppose I could at least do that. Ah, crap. Um, is it worth dispelling? He's not resistant at all, so yes, it is.
What are they weak against? Explosions and Earth. You don't have those. So this battle's pretty much over. I think, since I really doubt anything interesting is going to happen, I'll skip to the end of this. Okay, this should be enough. A couple turns later, I managed to beat it. The Captain of Death. Alright. Heal us all up. And now... The final battle. The duel that we've all been waiting for. I'm not gonna hold back. Sorry, Anna. That thing doesn't even look like me. The hair color's all wrong, amongst other things. Um... Yeah, the hair color is wrong, but... Actually... Yeah, there are multiple inconsistencies. Summit. Dark Anna. Use many uses many elements and status effects, including poison, earth, wind, thunder, and ice. Summons undead bears and evil worms. It's weak to fire and light, so be right back. Oh look, another little brat for us to babysit. Okay, that was random. Okay, so no more text, sadly. But, and mind you, but, uh, actually, who do I want on this party? Yeah, I'll use him and start taking them down. We need all the defenses and magic defenses. Limit break go. Okay, Genesis, so we can all have res. Still no way to skip this. Attack you both. And attack you both. And heal. Okay, so tiring reduces evade and accuracy. Alright, that's unfortunate. That means I gotta use her turns to fix us. Uh, let's raise. Let's fix this. Status effects are the worst, and I always used a lot of them. Okay, fix you. And attack. Right. Easy enough. And since she attacked Anna that one turn. Oh no. Ahem. Since she attacked Anna that one turn, I was about to say that, oh, things are going well because Anna was healing herself. Uh, not anymore. Okay. Resurrect you. And 
We're not attacking this turn. We're healing. Ah, yes. Most unfortunate. Okay. Fix your status problem. Buff Anna. And just to be sure... Okay, it is physical. It is light, which they're all weak against. Let's do this. Nice. Boss battles are a lot easier than horde battles. I've been saying it for episodes, but I'll just keep on saying it. Ow. <laughs> um, let's target the ads. Not what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to do that one. Uh, she just had to steal my freezing arrow skill. That'll freeze 100% of the time. Uh, what's your... Oh, yeah, you're mean to freeze. Okay, cool. Uh, da, da, da. You know what? Just use it. Boom. And cast just an auto res on you. That way you can be the bait. Perfect. <laughs> for some reason, she keeps targeting Matt, which is just a bad idea for her. Limit break. Ah, this is about to hurt. Okay. Thank you. I was hoping it wouldn't dispel. Dispel, not dispel. Yeah, whatever. Resurrect you. I should do a multi attack on all of them. Oh no. Regenerate. I didn't even notice that. It's a really bad idea for them just to keep targeting Matt. He's immune to that. Okay, um... Coffee. Way you feel... Okay, we need the... You know what? Crisps. Let's do it. And try to dispel that so they don't gain more health. Did not work on her. Oh no, so bad. All her physical attacks seem to have a flavor of poison to them. Perfect. So, guaranteed crit on you. Oh, no, it wore off because of the thing. Ah, oh, that's the worst. Okay, um... How is that not enough? Whatever. Ow. Alright, so this battle seems to just be going in my favor. We'll see if that changes, though. Cool, stagger. Uh, let's do this. Focus damage on you. And use Genesis.
Perfect. He is so dumb. Uh, she is so dumb, I should say. She just keeps doing that over and over again. Done. I just killed myself. Feels bad, man. I mean, yeah, that works. Shadow Huntress. Done. Okay, so this next thing's gonna be terrible and awful. It's probably gonna be something like everyone in one battle and they get to swap out party members. It's gonna be yeah. Slime Cat King? What? Never mind. I thought Where's the Slime Cat King medal? Uh up here. Find all the slime cats and rule the world map. Angel Wing. May weaken targets. Boost the power of holy skills. Randomly cast arrow rain between turns. Okay, that's pretty cool. We've made it. We've reached the top of the mountain. And yet I think our troubles are just beginning. Still not much of a view. I guess drawing clouds is easier. Is this the final area of the game? Or did we... Is this still just Battle Mountain? I don't even know anymore. Drill Lance. May stagger targets boost the power of Earth skills. May cast Rock Fall with certain skills. Counter attacks with Quake. Okay. Death Scythe. Boost the power of Dark skills. May cast Death Spike with certain skills. Randomly cast Grim Reaper between turns. Alright. Food Shop. Item Shop. Huh. Pick up some of these since I've needed to anyway. Should be fine. Oh my gosh, a visitor. We haven't had any in ages. Welcome to the summit of Battle Mountain. We recommend finishing the rest of the game before trying to tackle the challenges up here, but whatever. Uh, okay. This way to the boss marathons. Bring your best equips. This way to the monster marathons. Remember to stock up on items. Okay. Um... Elixir of Life, Coconuts, and Soft Wood. Orange Juice, Chili Sauce, and Burgers. Uh, what's over here? You can fight every foe in the game up here on the Summit of Battle Mountain. They all respawn too. Hmm, so if we forgot to scan a foe, we can do that now. That's quite handy. Good luck, though. Fighting this many bosses in a row can get super tough. You'll need to get used to changing your equips during battle. Okay, what's down here? Ooh. Free stuff. Mithril, cake, and donut. Ah, to do this, though. Okay. I think what I'm going to do... Uh, how should I do this, though? Ugh. I'm going to break these rocks to get all the stuff from them. Yeah. The way I'm going to do this is I'm going to be a Dumbo and not do this. <laughs> I'm going to instead go on with the game and I'll come back to this. Never ending battles? Am I in heaven? Oh sure, it sounds good now, but I don't think you'll be so hyped after a few waves of beatings. Endless just means unbeatable. He is very actually correct. Oh man, these battles are too hard. I keep running out of items. I'll need to figure out some stra effective strategies, but I do know one thing. I've noticed the pattern in the endless battle. After every few waves, there's a tougher wave, and then all the monsters level up after that one. The enemy stats get incredibly high. Even small enemies become a serious threat. Be careful. Okay. Um, how to do this? That was easy. We got sushi, honeycomb, and orange juice. Oh well, this is it. I finally reached the end game. Nothing left to do now besides setting some high scores and getting some sweet achievements. Well, good for you, man. I'm just here for the items right now. Because I'm trying not to do all these horde battles because they're just not very fun right now. Okay, I guess I'll use my stat boosting items and then we'll move on to the end of the game. I think this episode is far longer than it needed to be. 
So what with the little bits I've cut out, I'm gonna guess it's around 30 to 40 minutes, hopefully, cross my fingers, probably 40 plus minutes actually because of the lance battle. Uh, so guys, I'll meet you guys at the end of the, like the end area of the game, whatever that area was called. It's been a while, I've forgotten what it's called. I'll see you all next time. <sighs> all right, wait 20 seconds and then we can move on. This is only one episode this far and this is gonna be an annoyance to edit like the rest of them, but it's not as bad as kindergarten. Kindergarten took way too long. Nine months to be to finish editing a game. God, that was awful.